five people in two different cases were charged at the Milimani Law Courts in Nairobi with conspiring to defraud the government of Kenya. Thousands of bags of subsidized fertilizer worth more than 49 million shillings. The accused persons include senior Ministry of Agriculture officials who facilitated the issuance of vouchers to fictitious farmers who targeted the fertilizer only to pump it back into the market in Kenya and Uganda at market price. Hassan Mugambi with the details. Before Chief Magistrate Bernard Ochoi at the Milimani Law Courts in Nairobi, Kipkorir Ronald Tanui and Edwin Ombui Oseko, both employees in the public sector, were jointly accused of conspiracy to defraud the government of Kenya of 19,913 bags, each containing 50 kilograms of subsidized fertilizer valued at 49.8 million Kenya shillings. The two were further charged with abuse of office. Kiprotich Ronald Tanui, who is the Assistant Director of Information, Communication and Technology at the Ministry of Agriculture, is alleged to have recommended the registration of Wilson Lutenya as a farmer owning 1,800 acres of land for crop farming in Meleo area of Narok County. This led to Lutenya redeeming a total of 7,200 bags of subsidized fertilizer valued at 18 million Kenya shillings an act which was prejudicial to the Agriculture and Livestock Department. Kiprotich is also accused of recommending the registration of Wilson Sesat as a farmer with 1,200 acres of land for crop farming at Sogo area of Narrow County, which would lead to the said person redeeming a total of 4,850 kilogram bags of fertilizer valued at 12 million Kenya shillings. Edwin Ombui Oseko, the principal agricultural officer and head of fertilizer unit at Kilimo House, is alleged to have instructed a junior officer in the ICT department to register Benjamin Mosbey Kuto as a farmer with 1,000 acres of land in Ololunga area of Narrow County, which led to the person redeeming a total of 4,304 bags of government subsidized fertilizer valued at 10.7 million Kenya shillings. The two government employees, however, did not answer to charges on Friday as Edwin was not in court. Kiprotij, who appeared in court, is out on a 100,000 police bond. The two are slated for plea taking on the 27th of November, 2023. In a different file, Bimak Kipchirchir, Samuel Kosgei and Harry Kiprop are accused of conspiring to defraud the government of Kenya 6,150 bags of fertilizer valued at 15.4 million Kenya shillings. The prosecution stated that Kipchirchir, between September 4th and October 16th this year, at various national cereals and produce board depots and the Kenyan National Trading Corporation depots, alleged to own 750 acres of land in Narok to obtain 3,349 bags of fertilizer worth 8.5 million Kenya shillings. As for Kipkos Gay, he is accused that between August 3rd and September 23rd this year, he lied that he owns a parcel of land measuring 600 acres in Kilgoris, Narok County, to obtain 2,801 bags of subsidized fertilizer worth 7 million Kenya shillings. The three denied the charges before Milimani Law Court and Senior Principal Magistrate Bernard Ochoi ordered them to pay a bond of 8 million Kenya shillings each with one surety of the same amount or a cash bill of 4 million Kenya shillings. The matter will be mentioned on the 8th of December this year for the pre-trial hearing. Hassan Mugambi, Citizen TV. We have attached 